Well, Dan, tough uh, loss tonight. Uh, you know, despite some horrific officiating, uh, Brahmins actually didn't play too bad tonight. Uh, what are your thoughts on the game? I disagree with you. I didn't think we played a very good game at all. I thought it was one of our uh, one of our weakest games all year. I think we gave them that game. Um, they got a great team, don't get me wrong, but we did not play the style of game that we are accustomed to starting to get to play. What do you think went wrong specifically? I just don't think some, some guys aren't stepping up knowing where they're supposed to be or playing hard. It's a one and done. Um, what I mean by that is it's a first effort and you know we have we need guys doing first and second efforts all uh, all game long. You think the boys uh, just kind of lost steam or just weren't really there all night? I just think guys, they, it's between their chests. Some guys that we, you know, if you look at Phil Fox, the way he competes out there, now that's what we're looking for. And, you know, Haji and, you know, I'm not going to name all the names, but there's, there's guys that do it consistently all the time. And then there's guys that just don't. It's like a swing and they're done. And very frustrating to watch and uh, it's frustrating to... We need guys to step up here. They, we know they can do it, and it has to be consistent. And we got a young team, and we have to understand that that has to be a priority of ours to be more consistent. How long does it take to say uh, for some guys to get that in their heads, or do you just have to make a decision at some point? I'm not too sure. I, uh, you know, it sometimes it takes guys a couple of weeks. Sometimes it takes guys a couple of months. So we need them to pick it up quick. And uh, the message was loud and clear after the game. Going into tomorrow's game, uh, Tulsa's a, a wounded beast out there, but you know certainly not a pushover team. Uh, what are your thoughts coming into that tomorrow? You know they're going to be hungry. When you're hungry, it's important that uh, you know you don't take them lightly, and you got to be ready. They got a great team. Um, you know they've been struggling as late, and their confidence isn't there. So we have to have a good start until we can hopefully uh, you know make sure that. We get a get a W tomorrow. How frustrated are you at this point in the season? It's still early enough, but you know, heading into mid December and being where we're at right now, uh, you know, does that just eat at you? Well, I feel like we're taking steps forward, and then we take steps back. Um, I thought we were starting to be on the right page, and it's very frustrating to watch that tonight. Um, even if we won the game, I'd be, feel the same way. It's not just because we lost the game. It's it's uh, the way, we, a style that we are accustomed to playing for two around here, and I, I didn't see it tonight. Are guys just not buying into your systems? Are they no. resistant? or? I don't think they're not buying in. I just don't think the work ethic has to be there. And um, I just don't think it's consistent enough. It's, like I said, you need first and second half. Not just first efforts, but second and third efforts. And that's how you win. Like, if, for example, if the puck's lying there, you're not just, I got my guy, and then their guy picks up the puck and gone. It's like, boom, and I work, work and look for that next, next opportunity. Thanks, Dan. Thank you.